Yes, people, what is happening? It's your favorite Assassin Viking Ivor here. And today we're going to be playing some more Assassin's Creed Valhalla. If you're new here and if you want to support this channel, make sure to subscribe for Odin and for Valhalla. Sigurd, shall we then, Eivor, to Norway and well beyond? To Norway, then. Good, good! Lead on! So strange. Little has changed, but it feels unfamiliar. A few years abroad have shaped us more than all the decades we spent here, brother. And it's bloody cold. Colder than I remember. This is Harold's Fair Hair's kingdom now. Every peak and fjord pains me to say it, to think it even. And our father is full, a poor man. It is a role he chose. He bent easily and broke in half. Do not pity him. No. For many moons I could not sleep, always thinking of his betrayal. The horrors I wished upon him. He deserves nothing but shame now. Put it out of your mind, Sigurd. There's no need to hound the old man. No. He must taste the same foulness that I taste. He must know what glory he missed by staying here, the lapdog of a conqueror. You want to speak with him? Yes. Face to face. I will tell him the truth. Alric starts. It thrives. In spite of our father, no doubt. Are you sure of this? I will say what needs to be said. Do you fear his rebuke? Oh, no. I crave it. It may be the old hound has lost his bark. Or it may be you will light a fire beneath him. Inspire him with tales of our glory. If I do, I'll stoke that flame until it burns. Hold on you. What do you see? Take me, A4. Our victories will order the gods themselves. What was it, Randy said? Our father spends his days in the meat halls and his nights on barren planks of wood. That's right. We'll search the meat halls. I remember one nearby. A sad hole where men... There you I remember one nearby. A sad hole where men soak their unhappiness. We should look there. Come empty-handed. Not even a gift to offer. Rats don't appreciate sundown. gifts. Just they sniff and lick staring into his without care. Once, you are just a brother. Once, I'd have him take a bath. He was a king once, that one. We should go. Look at him. Father.
Seeger? My son, Eivor, by Odin's blessing, come and let me look at you Stop. both. Stop. That is far enough. Blood of cheer. What happened there? A grievous wound you have. Are you well? Far better than I look, I assure you. This... this calls for a toast. Your journey must have been long and cold. A drink to warm your blood! We are not here to drink or make merry. Only to look upon the rackets of a once great man. And then what? Make new war against King Harald? Stake a claim on his crown? Is that your wish? To sow more chaos here? <laughs> You're absurd, old man. What could possibly interest me in this frozen backwater? I heard rumors that England was infested with kings already. I thought maybe... Maybe you would return here to... Uh... I have cast aside all dreams of kingship, father. A much greater end lies in wait for me. <laughs> I have returned for one reason only, to say goodbye, and to thank you for your colossal failure. Failure? As a father, as a king, as a man. For without it, I would not have discovered my true self. My failure, as you call it. My oath to King Harald was the only sensible path forward for a man in my situation. What have you done with yourself since? Drink heavily and weep for what might have been? I have... I have worked hard to broker peace across our land. To spread Harald's message of unity. I heard you sleep beneath Harald's bed. Always at his back and call. And that he uses your gaping mouth as a chamber pot. You make light of my service to a great and powerful man. Is that how you treat those who serve you, Sigurd? You pathetic worm! Sigurd, this is not why we came. Plans change. As do hearts. Not this one. And you, Eivor? You should have told us of your plan to bend the knee to Harald. ...and spared me the shame of seeing my father debase himself like a gutted pig! You are right. I owed you the truth, and for that I am sorry. But I will not apologize for what I did. Then I have nothing left to say to you. My son, please! Sigurd, wait. I have spoken my words, and he has spoken his. And from this class came bitterness. What more need be said? I wish you well, Sigurd, in spite of all that has happened. I hope you find what you seek, and that it brings you peace. It will. Our destiny awaits. Do not linger long. I know you love him, Eivor. I know you trust him. But do not follow him blindly into darkness or despair. This sad business is finished. Good riddance. And now we sail for further shores. To my true purpose. To my destiny. To the end of my road. I will follow you as far as you wish in this world, brother. But if you mean to take us further, I may reconsider. I do not think you will, Eivor. I think you will marvel at what I have to show you. Still dwelling on your father? Not at all. 
I was only reflecting on my visions, wondering at them, how present they are, like memories of yesterday. Describe them for me, your visions. My earliest was of a large door embedded in ice, far north of Hördafilke. The saga stone embedded at the top of its arch. As the visions grew stronger, the door opened, revealing many things. The life tree Yggdrasil, the golden fields of Valhalla, and the faces of our gods, all of whom called me friend, brother, warrior. I felt at home among them, warmed by their love. You should know, you are not alone in this. I too have had visions. Have you? And what did they foretell? It is hard to say. I've seen Odin leading me into shadows. I've seen spinners weaving wild destinies from pools of blood. I saw the great beast Fenrir. The branches of the world tree, and a man with... Go on. Valka warned me of a great betrayal, but what form it takes I cannot say. I see. I hold to my oath, Sigurd. You know that. Betrayal is not in my nature. Of course not. You are a stalwart as a pillar of stone. Come now. My destiny awaits. Another Ocar came after it. To the Swan Road. Sail. See who catch the wind. The daughters of Aegir bless our passage. Yes. I feel a great calm as we cross these waves. This will deal with the Elf King, Alfred. How far have you pushed him? Does he bend? Will he break? Guthrum's army will be chasing him across Wessex now. Good luck, he will push Alfred into the sea. Strange how these earthly concerns seem so distant to me. But we've gained so much in England, and we stand to win even more. The Christians are hardy foes. They see one man above who holds the axe. One man higher than us all. That is a powerful fuel. We hold our own axe. We swing it where we may. The woman, Fulke. In my time with her, as painful as it was, she showed me things. Things so strange and wonderful, I am almost grateful for her treachery. What she did to you was cruel beyond measure. Yet, with every snap of the flame, with every scar, the loss of my arm, my visions grew stronger. If you can find the good in that, fine. But she was as mad as the ocean is wide. Even the Mad Ones can offer wisdom. Their Jesus was an odd fellow. Now half the known world loves him. And no one believed us when we were young, and we chiseled our plants onto tables in meat halls. Not even my father. There is the secret I know well. Can we not return to England and finish together what we began? No, forget all that. The future is forward. A great wealth awaits us. I'm with you, brother. Until the end. A white rage stands in our way. Keep moving forward! Do you know the way? As I know my own mind! We will cut through this winter sheet like swords through straw! Do not worry! To Paris and a lonely fjord! We'd be the shame of our clan! Ha! That we would! Yes, this feels 
familiar. Eivor, we will press on. The rest of you, wait here. quiets down with a ship where we have mead and food to warm us no we must confront the omens and honor the gods they will not seek or find you we must go to them we would be poor company with frozen bones and ice pellet for ice you need not fear the cold avon where we are going the winds and snows cannot touch frozen lake. This must be it. And ahead lies a cavern. Will you not say where this leads? Ah, you will see soon enough. I'm too late to turn back, I fear. There! The cave! Within hides the sacred gate. looks fragile. Can you clear it? The ice looks fragile. Can you clear it? Races. This is it. Gods. This door. Have you seen this before? The space above. The Saka Stone sat there, did it not? Long, long ago, yes. Now stand clear. Svachoi nogvat uns membro trurvon di gvorde, uns solas vras gnogadide. Unsum hukas reis derae How did you do this? Where did you learn these words? I told you, Eivor. My visions are memories of a life once lived. Come, gods. What is this place?
Over here. This plate will lead us onward. Sigurd, I... I don't know what to say. This is... all so strange. Trust this place, Eivor. This old and sacred place. Where does it lead? To the Hall of the Slain and the Golden Fields. To Valhalla. tree the tree of life what is this see how proudly she sits how beautiful she gleams here all the roots of life run together the skulls would cry to behold such a sight and there is more to come i swear by all the names of the old father this is only a taste of what i have in store for you for my visions go further to odin's great hall There. Do you feel that? The sacred energies? I have never seen something so grand. This shrine is ours. It will open for us. Watch and see for yourself. How do you know these things? Was all this in your vision? All this and more. Yes, it is returning to me now. This ancient shrine is set alight by the sphere of metal. And these shining arms, these branches, they will grant us access to the refuse of the gods, to Valhalla. Are you ready? What lies beyond all this? Where does this lead? Take your place at the center there. And you will see.
What is this place? After all this time, Eivor, we have arrived. Now raise a horn with Freya here and sing a victory song. Sigurd, what is all this? Your, your arm has returned, and your vicar as well. Glory eternal, Eivor. Here we dine in the great hall of the slain, at long last. Oh, I want to scream with joy. This is... this is all so beautiful. Your visions were... They were real. The battle her blows! Come, dear! To the field! Fight with us! Go, Eivor. Enjoy the fight. You have earned your place here. Incredible! Enough with those short flies! You and I must fight! The battle we never had! And hold nothing back, for here we need not fear a thing! Spill the eternal blood of Valhalla! Not Eivor. <laughs> For we earn no scars here, only battle wisdom. Has grown back. It was never gone, Eivor. Not truly. Nothing is permanent here. I told you. 
Nothing save the courage and reputation of its warriors. Are we immortal in this place? <laughs> Let us discover that together. A new day. to the marrow's bed. Again, you've lost your arm. And again it will be... Oh. Father? Is that you? Join the battle cheer. Dearest Skull, the war and verse, how do you like this frenzy so far? It is... it is quite something. Raise your horn, Eivor. What stops you? My father, Varen. Have you seen him in this hall? I have not. Should he be here? No, he died a coward. Yet by Odin's eye, I swear I've seen him. Cast aside your cares in Valhalla. Let Seeking go. We have earned our joy. The journey is complete. Seen Varen. Who? Varen. Varen? Father? his fucking arm, I'll beat a man to death with it! Do you not tire of his injuries? Never!
Eivor, you have a guest. You should have knocked first. Nonsense! I brought you someone. Luke! My Eivor! There you are! What a warrior you have made of yourself! I am overfilled with pride. How did you find your way here? You remember our great battle? You remember how we fought, side by side, with your mother and Sigurd and our clans united? We fought, father. But you did not. You died a coward. Eivor, enjoy this. Your father has returned. Have you lost all your love for life? That was not my father. That was a lie. That was not a lie. That was my gift to you. I have power here, and I can do as I please. You wish to see your father. I made it happen. As easy as breathing. By Odin's laws, my father is not allowed in this place. I do not wish to see him where he should not be. Your father died doing what he hoped would save you. He died to protect you and his clan. No. He... This is the end of our road, Eivor. This is Valhalla, the eternal golden field. Now come. Battle beckons. How is all this possible? How were the slain brought here? The Valkyries know this. Only them. No. That cannot be true. None of this feels right. Do not despair, Eivor. Look. Your friends are here. Everyone you could ever want is here beside you. real. This place can be whatever you wish it to be, Eivor. I do not want it. Not like this. You would resign yourself to an empty death? The ecstasy I feel here is an illusion. I would sooner call like a raven than sing a false song. Illusion or not, here there is no death, no pain, no loss, no betrayal, not like out there. You want this? To live inside a lie? I am an old woman with a broken body. What life I had left was brief, so I bid farewell to my dear Volka, and came here. I wish you well, Swala, but this is not for me. I must find Sigurd. The arm! The arm! 
always the fucking arm. Sigurd, this is an illusion. A trick. Leave with me now, and return to England with me. Our people need us. No. I am no one in that world. I am somebody here. Powerful. Capable. A god. Here I may live forever. Here I cannot die. Cows die. Family die. You must die. The only thing that never dies is the reputation of the one who's died. In here, you have no reputation. But out there, it's not too late. Every day the same empty war, the same hollow victory, spilling blood that tastes of water and smells of grass. You have known real battle, real glory, but this is not it. You know this. I know you do. Brother, it is time to leave. Am I destined to follow you everywhere? To the end of my life? All right. We go. No, you stay. I do not give you leave to go.